some harmonics. Uh, this is just a video about explaining harmonics and then there are three other videos in the series about exercises to learn how to do this particular harmonic position. So we are, imagine that you measured between here and here. The easiest harmonic on your violin is halfway between. So it's sort of like, it's actually fourth position, but your hand is kind of in third position because then you straighten your finger, which gives you some extra length. So ordinarily we don't want to play with straight fingers, but this makes it much easier to keep it really light. So you've got to have a light finger, but a heavy bow to get that sound. And in this position, if you press your finger down, it does sound the same pitch. But in other places where you play harmonics, like here, for example, the third finger on the A string, you can hear that it sounds much higher than that. It's actually two octaves above open A. So the rules for harmonics are, because both sides of the string, either side of your finger, are vibrating, unlike a normal note where anything that happens behind doesn't make any difference because the string is stopped, you are playing both sides are vibrating, so therefore if you put a finger on, or anything is blocking the string underneath your finger that's doing the harmonic, it won't sound. So here we have a good harmonic, and if I just touch my finger really lightly behind my fourth finger, just makes a horrible sound. So you have to have a clear string. You want to make sure that as you shift in and out of the harmonic position, that your left wrist is not moving about like this, and that you take your thumb with you. So I'm just gonna turn around so that you can see that. So you are not doing this and extending the fingers just without taking the thumb. You're taking the whole hand and then extending the fourth finger. So you should be able to find this note and you might find it helpful to put a little sticker on the fingerboard there so that you can see where you're aiming for because it's a long way away from first position. So there's what your A harmonic should sound like and it is an A, an octave above. Here's your E harmonic, your A harmonic, D harmonic and G harmonic. And all of the harmonics you can play, there are loads of them, so where the third finger in first position is. where your fourth finger is. So you can play things like lots of different sounds there. Um, so play around with harmonics, look at my other videos to see we've got a harmonic twinkle, a harmonic allegro and a harmonic perpetual motion for you to practice.